Hey everyone, okay, so today I'm gonna to be talking you through two, maybe three foundation tips for infinitely more beautiful results. Now about four, maybe five years ago, um, I shared with you the oil technique, which is how you apply oil to your foundation for more beautiful results. Now, at the time of releasing that video, I couldn't find any other videos on YouTube about this technique, and it is such a beautiful technique because it gives the skin a more beautiful appearance, especially as you get older and in your 40s onwards. I would classify myself in that range as I'm 39. So, maybe I get a little bit of credit for that technique. No? Fair enough. Cheese stands alone. So, on to the techniques and the, the tips and tricks with regards to getting more beautiful foundation. The reason for adding oil to your foundation is to make the skin more luminous, more hydrated, and less likely of caking. Now, the reason that we apply oil as opposed to water is water will thin down the formula, as in it will alter the formula. Oil won't, it won't diminish the formula you're using. Now, I tend to prefer to use a waterproof foundation or a very, very long lasting foundation, and all the products I like are in the description bar below, including really affordable options for these oils. So the way to go about it is to add one to three drops of oil to your foundation. Now, I prefer to err on the side of more than less. So I add about three drops to the foundation. I mix it in the palm of my hand, then apply it to the skin with a beauty blender. When it comes to, and this will look infinitely better when you apply powder, because powder can cake and look heavy. With the oil method, it won't. It will look so much more beautiful. So that's one of the greatest things. Two is to add one to three drops of oil to your beauty blender. And then you apply your concealer and then go over with the beauty blender with the oil that is already applied to it. Again, you will notice an infinite difference when applying powder to the eye area. The whole thing will just look so much more beautiful and less cakey, less wrinkly, just all round much, much better. When you're picking your foundation, all I say is, Try to stay away from water-based foundations, MAC face and body, because oil and water do not mix very well at all. But you can use it, but they don't really mix. Silicone foundations tend to accept oil much, much better, and almost all foundations on the market are silicone-based, so you can bear that in mind. Now, the funny thing is with the oil method is that you see it a lot on Instagram, it's everywhere, right? And it's mostly young girls doing it who truthfully probably don't need it unless they have very dry skin. If you've got very oily skin and you're adding more oil to it, maybe not the best thing. You've already got that natural glow which is gonna come through in a couple of hours after your foundation is set. But generally speaking, the oil method is one of the most beautiful for applying your makeup to really give the most gorgeous finish to the skin. And it's one that I use every single day on clients. Now, again, all the oils are in the description bar. You don't need a really fancy one. You can absolutely just get one that's affordable to you and will work exactly the same way. But I've listed all the products in the description bar, which are truly wonderful, wonderful oils. There you go. Now, don't forget to like this video, which you probably won't do, and don't forget to share it, which I know you're not going to do. I ain't sharing shit, Wayne. Yeah, I know, but it would be nice. This is all I'm saying. Anyway, let me know your thoughts and your thoughts on the oil method. Leave them in the comment section below because I do have a peruse, you know, and I'll see you all soon. I appreciate your time. Thank you. Bye-bye.